So I'm with Tammy, who is the angel uh, housing coordinator for Justice Center, which serves uh, only seniors, only homeless seniors ages 50 and older. 55 and, 55 and older, sorry. And so Tammy was just telling me that previously she was able to get about 30 seniors housed per month. Back in 2016. And what is it down to now? It's this month, it's been three, four so far this month. And why? Because there's, because the, the rents have increased so much. Um, I have folks that are waiting to get, you know, to get into senior housing or housing for the disabled. And a lot of those places have a year, three, you know, two years, three years, up to five years wait list. And what are, what are these older folks supposed to do for a year to five years while they wait? So they're bouncing from shelter to shelter or they're staying on the street. They're sleeping at bus stops. Um, in their car if they their, have one. Their, their car, tents, wherever they can. So do you think it is a beyond a crisis at this point? Absolutely. And what do you think some of the answers are? What are some of the solutions? Do it, given the fact that you've done this for how many years now? I've been working with the homeless population since 2005. Is it worse than you've ever seen? Absolutely. And what do you think some of the solutions I are? I think some of the solutions are to build more uh, permanent supportive housing, to build more senior housing, also, um, rent control. Um, I see you're seeing a lot of seniors just flat out priced out of their housing. Absolutely. And how much have their rents increased? Um, usually it's three, four, sometimes 500 a month. And they just can't afford it. Absolutely, they cannot afford it on a fixed income. Yeah. Well, thanks for trying, but to go from 30 people housed a month to how many? So far, three to four this month. Three to four people, and just because there's no... There's nothing, there's no movement, there's no availability. Okay, thank you so much, Tammy. Thank you. Thank you.